The Fujera 2 reverse osmosis desalination plant is part of the largest hybrid desalination plant in the United Arab Emirates and one of the largest in the world. The 136 megalitre per day reverse osmosis plant is linked to a power plant and a thermal desalination plant. The entire treatment process consists of a seawater intake with chlorination, dissolved air flotation, gravity filtration, cartridge filtration, two-pass reverse osmosis, followed by blending and remineralization. Seawater from the Gulf of Amman is chlorinated and screened to prevent marine life from entering the plant. The screened seawater is then pumped with four turbine pumps for pre-treatment. The first pre-treatment step comprises coagulation and flocculation through chemical addition and mixing to form small flock, followed by the innovative Veolia Spid Flow Dissolved Air Flotation process which separates the flock, suspended particles and algae from the seawater. Microscopic air bubbles are produced, which attach to the particles, causing them to float to the water surface, resulting in a brown scum layer. This layer is periodically removed as waste. The 16 DAF units have been purposely added as a barrier against red and green algae and other related organisms that are known to cause harmful algae blooms and red tides. The seawater is filtered through 10 filters, each containing a layer of special volcanic material called pumice on top of a quartzite sand layer. The filtered seawater flows into a filtered water storage tank below the filters. After filtration times of between 40 to 60 hours, filters become dirty, requiring them to be backwashed one by one in order to remove all accumulated suspended material. The filtered seawater in the storage tank is pumped with 10 special booster pumps to the cartridge filters for further cleaning. All wastewater and scum is treated and dewatered with two centrifuges to produce a dry sludge for safe disposal. The seawater polishing step comprises 16 cartridge filter vessels. During this step, all particles above 10 micron in size are removed to produce high quality feed water in order to protect the reverse osmosis membranes. Dirty filters are periodically removed and replaced for disposal under strict disposal regulations. Following cartridge filtration, the polished seawater is sent to the partial two-pass reverse osmosis process. Reverse osmosis is the process whereby water is separated from the salts and other impurities with special purpose spiral wound membranes at 65 bar pressure. During operation, anti-scaling chemicals are purposely injected to prevent membrane scaling, which can cause irreversible damage and premature production loss. Membranes requires periodic cleaning with special chemicals, such as caustic soda lye and citric acid. The first pass process consists of 10 first pass racks, 10 special high-pressure pumps are used to achieve the separation process, which takes place inside each pressure vessel, resulting in a permeate and brine stream. The energy in the form of 60 bar pressure remaining in the brine is recovered with Pelton turbines to drive the high-pressure pump motors.
The second pass reverse osmosis process consists of two racks. Unwanted boron is removed from the permeate in order to ensure the compliance of water quality regulations. The final permeate is blended with MED distillate, remineralized, disinfected and stored in four huge tanks before distribution to consumers. The Fujera 2 reverse osmosis plant comprises state-of-the-art proven technology which contributes to the overall Fujera 2 project in achieving reliable supply of potable water for economic growth and the general well-being of all UAE residents in a water-scarce environment. The Fujera 2 reverse osmosis plant is operated and maintained by Veolia and yet another example of how Veolia contributes to resourcing the world.